Hey, Bella Buddies, thanks for watching. Okay, you guys, I have part two of the featured members video. And what these are, are big money bolo items that members of my Bolo Buddies YouTube channel found. So I'm going to tell you where they got it, what they paid for it, and what it sold for. And you guys, be prepared to be like, wow, because these bolos are amazing. And so are these eBay sellers and YouTube resellers. So their links are down below in the description of the video. So be sure to go down there and subscribe to the channels and check out the eBay stores. All right, you guys, are you ready? Let's get started. All right, so the first item was sold by Vintage Barbie, and she doesn't have any content yet, but she is looking to add content here in the near future. So go ahead and subscribe to her. Let me make sure that my screen share is up. Sub her up. Um, I think she's going to do a video on Vintage Barbies. So if you want to learn more about that, definitely go check her out. All right, you guys, what did she sell? So you guys, this is amazing. It is a Heidi Steiner jointed elephant. Um, it's weighted and it has glass eyes. And I just think this is fantastic. Heidi Steiner. So there's a tag still attached. Definitely vintage, it looks like. And it's got on the little navy outfit. You guys, she put this up for auction and it sold for $216.72. So very, very cool bolo. She picked this up in an estate sale and a bundle of uh, stuffed animals plush for $40. The next item comes from Cha-Ching King, you guys. He is putting out some amazing content. So if you are new to eBay and you want to learn step-by-step -step how to open an account, um, so let's say you're on Poshmark and Mercari and not on eBay, he has a video that walks you through it. Um, fantastic content. Go check him out. Uh, he's new to membership. So thank you, Scott, for joining. I appreciate you. And I appreciate all of the members very, very much. You guys, it means a lot to me that you guys trust me to uh, share your bolos. So we are uh, going to look at his bolo item. And you guys, hold on to your socks. Are you ready for this one? Oh, my goodness. So Art Nueve Dom Nancy Green with Gilded Gold Glass Dresser Jar. What? You guys, it sold for $1,200. Are you kidding me? And guess how much he paid for it. Are you ready? $10. Yeah, I said $10. And he got this at an estate sale. So pretty fantastic. Let me know in the comments, would you have picked this up or would you have been like $10? I'm not paying $10 and walked right past it. All right. The next item comes from the Thrifty Nichols and you got to go check out her channel. She is newer to YouTube. She is sitting at 29 subscribers, you guys. So let's help her get to a hundred. Um, go check her out. She does do a lot of hard goods and she has some great bolos. So what did she sell? Well, let me tell you. She sold this. It is a Martha Polin pleater smocking machine for gathering pleats. And it comes with the needles box. Um, she got this at an estate sale and she paid $10 for it. And it sold for $199.99 plus shipping. And look at the needles, you guys. So very, very cool piece. She included a photo of the, uh, well, that might be an advertising thing, return policy. I was going to say instructions, but so always uh, take pictures of everything included. The next item comes from Queen of Hearts Charnel, and she does not have an eBay store yet, but you can check her out her items with the link down below. Um, she's got this nice Cutco block. I'm surprised she has that so cheap. Oh my goodness, you guys, I have done really well with Cutco blocks. This looks like it's a small one. It's only five by four by four, so that could be why, but um, I think in the past I've sold one for like 45 or 60. I can't remember what it was, but it held a lot of knives. So the Cutco knives are definitely a bolo, but if you see the um, wooden blocks like that, they're definitely a bolo also. I'm guessing she probably did her research and um, has it priced accordingly, but definitely a very cool store, lots of variety. So you can check her out down below. And what did she sell? She sold this 1950s waffle iron. 
Um, really, really cool piece. Uh, let's see, where did she get this? She got this for free from her mom. Her mom used to use it when they were younger and she sold this for $76.99 plus shipping. So cookware and uh, pots, pans, different things like that. If you can find discontinued or vintage items, they do definitely sell well. The next item was sold by Restored Glory. Um, this is Donna's channel and she sold, well, first off, let me go down here. I just shared this video recently and I haven't updated my screen, but she talks about vintage glass. So um, if you guys want to know more about vintage glass, you're nef definitely not going to find that on my channel because I stay away from breakables and she likes that stuff and she sells on Etsy. So head on over to her channel and check that out. And hopefully she can answer any glass questions you have because I sure can't. All right. What did she sell? Speaking of glass, she sold these vintage retro MCM and poly wave pattern decanter set of two made in Italy. And boy, oh boy, are these beautiful. Um, she sold these on Mercari. And they are just fantastic. Um, $150, the buyer paid shipping. And she got these for $10, you guys, at a thrift store. So pretty fantastic. All right. The next item was sold by Lombardi Limited. And he does not have a YouTube channel, but he has a fantastic eBay store. He does a lot of hats. He does a lot of photos. Um, postcards, stuff like that. So he has a really cool store. So check that out. Wait until you see this bolo. I just think this is fantastic. Um, it's a cabinet card. And if you guys don't know what those are, they're kind of like a thicker photograph and you can put them inside the, the photo albums that hold cabinet cards. Um, I'm not really sure of all the details of what each thing is called, but it is thicker and it's definitely an old photo but this is called trick photography. It's the same woman with five angles. And I love his title because it explains exactly what you're getting. Um, very, very cool, very cool piece. And then it's got the information on the back. So he said he got this uh, for $3. It was part of a bulk buy. He paid $50 for a thousand cards. This sold for $98 and 95 cents with free shipping. All right, you guys. So before I continue, what I'm doing is I am showing you, um, I'm introducing you to either a channel or an eBay store, which are all linked down below. And then after I do that, we are going to have a speed round at the end. So you're going to get an additional 19, I think it is, bolos. Boom, 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 boom. So stay tuned for the speed round. All right. This one comes from Got Junk in Our Trunk. And she ran estate sales for a long time. So she is super, super knowledgeable. So definitely go check out her channel. She's got a bunch of what sold videos. And you guys that watch me, I know you love what solds. So uh, check that out. She got this vintage hand carved wooden power fist. It's like a tribal folk art statue, MCM. And it is very, very interesting and cool. Probably one of a kind. Um, never seen anything like that. But she got this at a yard sale for $2. She did take a best offer of $60 and the buyer paid shipping. The next item was sold by One Stop Shop 59. No uh, YouTube channel, just an amazing eBay store. Again, uh, these eBay stores are something else. It's a great way to learn by checking out what people are selling. Um, just great photos, great store. All right. This is pretty cool. It is a vintage cast iron bunny rabbit. Um, it's heavy. Um, it is vintage. It is cool. And I'm going to show you some close-ups here. Now, the thing is this had free shipping on it. So I don't know if this could have fit in like a uh, flat rate box or what. But um, she, she got this for free from a friend. So cost of goods was nothing. And it sold for $84.97 with free shipping. The next item comes from Flippin' It Good. And I've told you guys before that if you are looking to do retail arbitrage, this is your guy. But he is also your guy if you like vintage items because he sources a lot of really cool hard goods as well. Um, but he will go into Ross and he will pick up like... $50 shoes and sell them for big money or $25. Here, let me give you an example. I think I have a pair right here. 
Yes, these Doc Martens. All right, you guys, he got these at Ross for $34.99 and he flipped them for $170 plus shipping. The next item comes from Reselling with Honey and she has an awesome YouTube channel. She um, is just kind of getting into it, but just really good content for being in the early stages. And let me tell you, she's a bolo finder. So go check her out. And she sold this ultra rare Chessie Cat Railroad Kitten Twin Bedspread and Canopy Cover. Um, you guys, she got this at an estate sale for $5 and she flipped it for $149.99. Look how cute this is. If you like cats. All right. The next item comes from Electric Garage Sale. Again, no, no uh, YouTube channel, just an amazing eBay store. And I love it because um, most of the, the people that are signing up are not necessarily YouTubers. They're people that want to share their bolos from their eBay store, which is fantastic. And um, show them some support by checking out their eBay store down below. Maybe you'll see something you want to buy. All right. Electric Garage. What did he sell? He sold this vintage PS Alt duck call. And you guys, I have to say that I picked this one because I don't know if you saw the video where um, it's called We Split Up at this estate sale. And it's my, my husband and we went to an estate sale. We went separate ways and we grabbed a bag full of stuff and we brought it home and we shared with you guys what we found. And my husband actually found one of these, but it was a crow call and it was the same brand. So this one caught my eye. And he sold this for um, $99.95. He got it at an estate clean out. So the only cost he had was his labor. The next item comes from Jack's Treasures. You guys, they do a lot of storage units. They've got um, booths and they sell on eBay. And they have fantastic finds that they are finding in these storage units. Now, let me find. Here we go. Um, they sold. Okay, in a recent video, you guys saw that I sold one of these for $200. Mine was brand new, but mine did not have this down below. So this is a really neat feature of this item. Anything Mr. Christmas, pick it up if you can get it for a good deal. Um, even if this didn't work, they could have sold these, um, the music records. They could have sold those separately. They probably could have parted this out as replacement parts as well. They sold this for $159.99 and the buyer paid shipping. The next item comes from Gail's Resale in C. And she picked up, let me show you a little bit of her store here. Again, great items, great photos, lots of fun stuff in her store. She's got some toys. You guys know I love selling toys. Um, so I can always appreciate a toy seller. She sold this vintage maple leaf quilt. Um, it's hand stitched. Uh, it did have some issues, some loose strings, some fading on the edging and stuff like that. But she still sold this for $75 on best offer. And she picked this up at an estate sale clean out. The next item comes from Gigi's Gold Mine. And an, again, another amazing store. And I'm going to tell you about this cool little find. So I'm just going to show you a few things here if anything catches your eye. And this is a Robotron. It's a Rextron Dinotron figure. It's still in the original packaging. You guys, anytime you can find new old stock items, you can put NOS in the title. Sometimes people search that. But this guy is really, really cool. Um, they got this from a garage sale for 50 cents and took a best offer of 55. The next item comes from the Funky Pickle Thrifter. You guys, if you're looking to learn more about jewelry, she is super knowledgeable, but she is also super knowledgeable in other areas. Um, I also want to let you know that right here, the original Christmas song, she sings in this video and her voice is beautiful. So go check that out. But um, as a reseller, you probably want to know about her big money sales. So let's talk about this item. She sold, are you ready for this? It is a rare Harry Winston solid gold 14 karat bamboo pen with pouch. And it is authentic, you guys. Are you ready for this? I just want to make sure you're ready because you guys, these, these 
resellers are amazing. She got this at a yard sale for $1 and she took a best offer of 800 and the buyer paid shipping. <laughs> Can you believe she found a 14 karat gold pin at a yard sale for $1? I just, I couldn't believe it. I was expecting it, like when I sent her the, the picture, I was expecting her to come back with like, oh, I paid $500 for it and I sold it for 800. You know, I didn't expect I paid a dollar for it at a garage sale. All right, you guys, Nikki loves snacks. Check out her channel. She doesn't put a ton of content out, but when she does, it's worth watching. So go and subscribe to her, hit that bell. So you want, you know, when she posts a video. All right. She sold this Avon calendar, and I know you guys are probably like, we've heard about the Avon calendar, but I love the Avon calendar, and I feel like it's something that is so easily missed, um, and I want to share that with those of you that don't know. I recently just found my first one, and I'm super excited. It sold really quick, and definitely a bolo, you guys. She got this at the Goodwill for $2.99 and sold it for $155 plus shipping. The next item comes from farm girl scavenger Noel, and this girl is versed in so many things. She's super knowledgeable. If you're not if you're not following her, go follow her. She does these things on um, once a week. It's on Thursdays typically, and it's let's talk about it. And it's kind of like my bolo category video, but she's doing categories, but it's live, so you can ask questions. So check her out. She sold this starburst plate. It's a divided child's plate. Um, it's got the atomic starburst, which is very, very collectible MCM. And she got this from her aunt for free. And she sold this for $199 and 99 cents plus shipping. The next item comes from Toledo antique. Okay. So again, super knowledgeable. They do live sales over on their channel. So if you go and check them out and you are interested in buying things, sometimes they start things at $1. Um, which is just fantastic. They run estate sales, so they have a lot of inventory. Um, they're they're great. They will pay up for items if they know they're worth a lot. So you'll see what I'm saying. Let me show you this one. This is a rare signed Franco Moretti Murano art glass owl. Again, like I don't, I would not have thought that that would be worth that much money. Uh, this one actually was a consignment deal. So they do have people that reach out to them and say, okay, can we sell this on consignment? Um, and they will do that. But um, this sold for $299.99 plus shipping. The next item comes from Sisters Rescued Treasures. Um, this is their um, eBay store. They also sell on Mercari. So you can check them out over there. Lots of great items, great pictures. Um, and actually the one I'm going to show you, the buyer did not end up paying, unfortunately, but I thought it was too cool to not share it with you. So anthropomorphic is fruit and different things that have faces. So that is a great key word. I wanted to mention that, but look how cute these little guys are. So I'm guessing this is back up in their store. If anybody is interested, um, you should definitely go and check that out down below. Um, they're shelf sitters, you guys, and they're made of resin and originally it sold for $63.96, uh, plus shipping, but the buyer did not pay. So womp womp bummer, but I picked it out and I thought it was cute and I just wanted to share it with you guys anyway. The next item. Okay. You guys, it is speed round. Are you ready? We are going to move through these quick. I'm just going to tell you who sold it. And, um, again, all the links are down below. So be sure to subscribe and follow these eBay stores. Um, we've got cha -ching. Cha-ching King that sold this. It is a vintage Adidas sweatshirt Olympic game. Super, super cool. He picked this up at the Goodwill Benz. Um, it is pre-owned, but it looks to be like in really fantastic condition. This sold for, I don't know, he didn't tell me. I'm sorry, but he did take a best offer, but I'm guessing it did pretty well. The next item was sold by the Thrifty Nichols. And this is a Bacagon. Um, these are battle brawler cards. So I have done really well with um, Bacagon in general. And they're um, little balls that if a magnet hits them, they open up and transform. So this is just the cards. And she sold these for 55. I'm sorry. She took a best offer of $46.75. And she got these at a church consignment for $10.
The next item is this Fisher Price Little People North Pole Christmas Santa Cottage. And it looks like this is just the cottage, you guys. Um, if it had the minifigures, it probably would have went for even more. Um, so these play sets do, they do vary. So you want to look them up. This one, I'm guessing, is a little bit more rare. I've never seen this one, and it's the North Pole. So this probably sold around Christmas time. This, um, whoops, I forgot to delete this one. I didn't get the information from her um, in time. She had a crazy busy week and was not able to get me um, the info. So I apologize. I don't know what she paid for it or where she got it, but it's still awesome and good to know. The next item. Okay, this one came from, let me double check, Queen of Hearts Charnel. This is Revere, Revere Wear, I think is how you say it. And it is a um, stovetop coffee pot percolator copper clad. I don't know. Right there. That must be what the copper clad is. But it's from 1968, you guys. Super cool item. She got this at a thrift store for $2 and sold it for $77.04 plus shipping. The next item comes from Restored Glory. Um, her Mercari store is actually Duchess 0911. And she sold this smiley face clock on Mercari for $68 plus shipping. She got this at a thrift store for $5.99. The next item that sold is from um, Lombardi Limited. And again, he sells a lot of postcards, a lot of pictures, a lot of really cool vintage unique items. This is from the 1900s. Vintage muscular like men pictures like this, some of the muscle magazines, those can definitely be a bolo. This one photo went for $42.95 shipping and he got this also out of that bulk buy where he paid $50 for a thousand items. The next item comes from Got Junk in Our Trunk. She picked this up off the side of the road, so she got it free. It's a vintage glass prism drop garland chandelier parts. It's for parts because it's missing. Um, I think it's missing something right here. I mean, talk about beautiful. So somebody can use these for crafting or they can replace that piece. This sold for $150 best offer and the buyer paid shipping. The next item that sold is this vintage St. Anthony statue child Jesus uh, eight inch porcelain. So it's like a figure, figurine here. Um, very, very cool. Let's see, who did this come from? This came from One Stop Shop 59 eBay store. It was free at an estate sale clean out and sold it for a best offer of $37.98 plus shipping. So they did come down quite a bit on this item. Um, one thing I do recommend, and sometimes when you're loading the pictures, if you close it too quickly, they'll get cut off. So I don't know if that's what happened here or not, but always take a picture of the bottom just in case there's any markings. And if there's not markings, that'll let the buyer know. The next item that sold is this Nuji Robo Pong 2000 table tennis robot. Um, so again, I told you guys that Flippin' It Good does a lot of retail arbitrage, but he is also a bolo finder in other categories. He picked this up at a yard sale for $15, you guys, and he flipped it for $350. Now, I got to tell you, I definitely would not want to ship this thing. So kudos to him for figuring that out. I wonder if he did a video. That would be a great video on his channel. The next item comes from Reselling with Honey. This is a pair of Dorothy Thorpe Lucite Pretzel Twist Candlesticks. These are fantastic. I can see why these are a bolo. Um, just amazing. And she got these at an estate sale for $25 and they sold for $202.30 with free shipping. The next item came from Electric Garage Sale. This is so cool. This is a uh, collector's guide to old fruit jars, which is really just pretty interesting. And I would think that somebody that collects old jars would definitely be interested in something like this. Did a great job of showing the defects. I always take close-ups of the defects, really important. Um, he got this at an estate sale clean out. So just his labor. And this sold for $49.95 plus shipping. 
The next item is this vintage Campbell's soup fabric. It's 42 by 32 each curtain. Oh, it says, <clears throat> oh my goodness, excuse me. It says curtains, question mark, cutter. So maybe they were curtains and um, they're just damaged and they're saying that they can use it as a cutter piece to make whatever they want with it. Um, fabric, estate sale, $5, sold it for $89.99 plus shipping. The next item is this bedspread, and this was sold by Gail's New and Vintage, and she actually sold two of these for 49, oh, I'm sorry, she took a best offer of $39.99, and the buyer paid shipping. So old um, vintage bedspreads can definitely sell, you guys. People like the patterns, they're looking for that old vintage look, so um, definitely be on the lookout. The next item was sold by Gigi's Goldmine, and this is a Hawaiian dress. You guys, Hawaiian dresses are definitely something to be on the lookout for. This came from a garage sale for $3, and they sold it for $69.99 plus shipping. Here's Made in Hawaii, and here's the tag. So um, a lot of times they will say Made in Hawaii. The next item came from the Thrifty pickle or I'm sorry the funky pickle thrifter um antique so many thrifters um in the titles uh antique odd my oh a-u-d-e-m-a-i-r paris opera glasses you guys these are have a sterling silver handle on them how cool is that and then they've got the insects and the bugs is that cool I think it's pretty cool she sold these for $199 on auction and the buyer paid shipping and she got this at a yard sale for a dollar. I mean, is that her magic number? A dollar. She's the one that sold the 14 karat gold pen that she got for a dollar. So she is amazing at sourcing low. The next item came from Nikki Love Snacks. These are awesome. These are Disney Store Mickey and Minnie Christmas stockings. They're 3D, uh, 20 inch and rare or hard to find. And she sold these for um, 125 and the buyer paid shipping and she got these for nine dollars and i'm sorry wait i think 99 cents each at a thrift store so that's cool it's either nine dollars and 99 cents each or 99 cents i didn't put a period but there's only two nines so i think it's 99 cents this one came from noel farm girl scavenger and this is so cool this is christmas department store wrapping paper it is a huge roll of wrapping paper she went to an estate sale and um, I think it was like she went to help out at a clean out or something. I'm trying to remember all the details. Um, and it was in like a, a cubby, like under the stairs, I think. And I think she got it free. Yeah, free from an estate sale. So nice find, right? $169.99. And if you go over and watch the thrift battle on Primetime Treasure Hunters channel, um, that she was on. She talks more in depth about it if you want to know more detail. Check her out on Instagram also. She posts screenshots of all of her sales. Well, not maybe not all of them, but a lot of them. And it's a great way to learn quickly. The next item comes from Toledo Antique and they're crazy. They sell these big sets of dishes all the time, which just terrifies me. Um, no way would I take the time to do this, but kudos to them because they do an amazing job. They sell this stuff all the time. They do have a video over on their channel, Toledo Antique, that shows you how to pack dish sets. So if you want to know more about packing big sets of dishes like this, definitely go check that out. Um, estate sale, they paid $35 for it and it sold for 400 plus shipping. The next item comes from Sisters Rescued Treasures and these trees they picked up at a thrift store for $2 and they sold for 52. So they are art glass pine trees. So again, probably somebody picking these up and decorating for Christmas. And the last item here comes from Vintage Barbie. Um, she picked this up and actually a lot of Barbie items. So she has approximately $25 in this. It's something that's been sitting in her closet, she said, for a while. And she decided to look it up and could not believe what these dolls are selling for. I personally have never heard of this. So I was excited to see this. It's one thing that's going to be kind of on my be on the lookout for list. Um, Duchess Raven Waves, Lady Lovely Locks. Um, 
hard to find is HTF and NRFB is never removed from box. This is a great thing to put on vintage Barbies and stuff like that. That's where I see it the most. But this is some sort of uh, doll. Must be highly collectible and hard to find because she sold this for $224.72 plus shipping and this was an auction. All right, you guys, thank you so much for being here. Thank you for watching. Be sure to like, comment, subscribe, and share. If you're new to the channel, um, if you hit that bell, that will alert you when I post new videos. If you would like to have your Bolo featured in a video like this, um, you can hit that join button down below. You have to join at level two to be in the video. It's $4.99 a month. Um, my channel is completely free, you guys. This is just if you want the perks to be featured in the video. So again, level two. And if you don't see that join button, it is also down in the description of the video, a direct link. So check that out if you're interested. If not, no worries. Just come back and check out all the bolos. All right, you guys, thank you so much for being here. Again, thank you for watching. Check out the eBay stores and the YouTube channels down below. These people are a wealth of knowledge and you will learn so much from them. All right, you guys, thanks for watching.